What's up guys, welcome back to the channel, my name is Dean aka The Blue Crusader and today we're going to continue on the M Creator series that a lot of you guys have really been enjoying. Now, recently I've been quite sick. Recently I've had the flu, still run into a few problems which is why I haven't been uploading just as much but I've still been trying to upload every 2 or 3 days for you guys just so you've got content so that's basically an explanation. Still kind of a little bit sick but I wanted to put out an M Creator tutorial part today. So what we're going to be doing is we're actually going to be making a weapon. Now this isn't just a normal weapon like a sword, this is kind of a weapon like a bow but we're going to try and make a gun which is going to be pretty interesting. So what we're going to do, we're going to press on the plus to add a mod element and what you would do is you'd make this ranged item but what we need to do first is we need to click on resources and create a new texture and it wants to be block an item from a template and then what we need to do is we need to make a new texture. Now there's an actual texture called gun already so we can just make a ranged gun and I'm not sure if there's an AK-47, I think it's just gun. We'll just use the normal gun texture for now. You guys can make your own texture if you want to from scratch. But we'll use the gun for now. And guns are usually like black or grey. So we'll just make it black or grey and we'll lock the saturation so it kind of looks more detailed. And we'll just click use. And we're going to make this an item. We're going to call it mod range gun for an example. And then we can click on new mod element and click on ranged item. Now we're going to call this just mod gun or mod weapon range gun, just a name that we know what it is. And we're going to select the texture and it's basically a sniper so I guess we're going to kind of make it like a bow. So you can do a few custom events, you can add a few different procedures if you click on the plus. Things that will happen if we fire the weapon and things to do with projectiles. But we're just going to skip that for now, that's a little bit too advanced. I'm going to call the name of the item sniper rifle and then what we're going to do is we're going to put it into the combat category because technically it's a weapon and the max stack size needs to be one. Item for ammo, you can actually use this and you obviously leave it empty for ammo but if you do select it you can actually make an item use for the ammo so what i will do is afterwards i'll make a bullet item and we'll make it craftable and then we'll use the bullets as ammunition just to show you guys how to use that so what we're going to do is we're going to leave that blank for now shoot constantly when active we're not going to do that because that's like going to be an assault rifle style we want to make this into the style of a sniper so we're going to leave that unticked item usage count we're going to leave that ranged item currently we have arrow unfortunately you are going to have to use the arrow sound unless you import a custom sound yourself then you have to use the arrow sound but if you want to import a custom sound pretty easy now we can use creeper sounds i guess i guess we could use firework blast that kind of makes sense for a gunpowder style so we'll use entity.firework.blast for an explosion kind of sound the bullet model you can select a custom model and texture we're gonna leave that for now that doesn't matter because you need to make an actual 3d model for that bullet power one like a bow we're gonna put it on three not sure how this is going to be don't really know the specific values but hopefully that'll make it more powerful we'll make damages 10 item representing texture of bullet okay so i guess we have to select some texture of a bullet i guess a bullet the closest thing to that would be obsidian right so we'll select that and click next and now we have a weapon but if you want ammunition what you do is you go down to resources we make a new texture and there should already be a bullet texture here so we'll put the bullet on both layers and then we'll change the texture like we did before to grey and we'll lock the saturation and there we have a bullet so we'll use that click item item bullet and press exit now i think we need to make an item for the bullet click on create new mod element and we'll click create new item we'll call it mod item bullet gun just so we know what it's for and then we'll select the new texture we just made and we'll go across and we'll call it sniper round and the stack size 64 we'll put it under misc in fact we'll put it under combat maybe yeah we'll put it under combat and we'll just make it a random item that doesn't spawn so now if we click on edit on the actual gun we should be able to select the item for ammo and the item here is the bullet so we can now use that as the bullet now the only thing left to do is make the recipe to create the bullet so what we can do is we can click on this plus we can click on recipe down at the bottom now you want to call this mod recipe bullet sniper just in case you make another weapon we want to make it craftable so the last item here should be the bullet that's the result of what you craft it into 
and then we can I guess just put some random items in so I guess we could just put some st in fact sticks makes no sense we'll make it like an obsidian bullet so we'll put two obsidians on top of each other you know what we'll just put three obsidians on top of each other in a tower and that'll be how to make the bullet boom so now what we'll do is we'll test our mod and hopefully the weapon should work. To test your mod you want to click on this little play button here, start Minecraft test client environment and then that'll load up a test version of Minecraft with the mod already enabled so we can use it. Now that we have Minecraft open, we're going to click on single player, I'm going to dive into any world, I've got a few worlds that we used in a few of the last tutorial videos but we're just going to join any of them because it doesn't really matter and we're in our old biome we made now I'm gonna enlarge minecraft just so it's a little bit easy for you guys to see and then what we want to do is first of all we want to make a crafting bench and then what we want to do is get some obsidian and then we'll make a crafting bench and we'll put three of these obsidian pieces in and we have sniper rounds now obviously if we put a lot more in we can make a big stack of sniper rounds there we go and there we go so we have 10 sniper rounds now obviously we didn't make a recipe to craft the sniper rifle but I showed you how to make a crafting recipe so it's pretty simple to make one to make the sniper and we'll go into combat and now if everything works we should have the sniper rounds and the sniper rifle so we can go find a mob not sure if it's gonna work never made a gun before and you basically prime it and hold it back like a bow and boom you shoot and it hits and I guess the bullet you could see the bullet it was kind of like obsidian boom that's actually kind of powerful the only downside is obviously we can't aim down the scope like a proper sniper but you can use it also if you right click you can spam it and it will shoot a lot of bullets as you can see now one thing though which is kind of annoying is that the snipers not using the bullets and the bullets aren't going down now I'm not sure if that's because it's creative mode so we'll change game mode to one and as you can see now if we change it to survival mode the gun actually uses bullets so you're gonna have to actually use ammo now I thought that's because it didn't work but in creative mode you have unlimited ammo I guess so whilst you're in survival mode you just need to be careful because you do actually have to use bullets now you're gonna have to use a lot of obsidian to make these bullets these obsidian bullets but it's really your choice what you want the crafting recipe to be because you could actually make different items needed to craft the bullets but yeah so that's the tutorial on how to make a gun pretty simple I just wanted to make it quick if this M creator video helped you guys though definitely smash the like button because then I'll make more tutorials and make sure to subscribe because every single week we make new tutorials on M Creator, and you can make the best mod and you don't even need knowledge on how to code. So thanks a lot for watching guys and I'll see you next time.